Welcome my Capricorns. I'm back y'all with another video. Let's get into it. Y'all know I started to do y'all video. I started on y'all video last night and I had got interrupted. A point and call came through and I just did not continue the video. But I'm I'm thinking back on yesterday. It looks like a lot of you guys had got some some surprising news or some shocking news is getting ready to come in. Um, so let's see. Let's see what we get. Okay, because that was yesterday. That was the energy that was popping out for you guys. Like, all of a sudden, some type of news just, just came out of the blue. So let's see what we get today. Okay, so this is going to be for, for December 1st through the 7th. If you aren't subscribed, go ahead and click that bell. Go ahead and get subscribed because you don't want to miss out on future videos, okay? So let's talk. Guys, I've added some new items onto the website, guys. Go ahead over to www.empressempireoils.com um, to check out the items, guys. Some dope, dope, dope items over there and the oils over there are popping okay <laughs> all right so let's talk oh yeah guys as well if you want to book a personal reading this month i think that i'm going to be going live more this month um i'm going to be going live more so you guys can catch me live guys i will be doing like a um a pre-video, you know, to let everyone know ahead of time, as well as I'll be posting in the community tab to let you guys know when I'm going live. So if you want a live reading, I'm going to be doing those all month long, okay? But if you want something personal, um, you can contact me via email and we can get you set up for a personal reading, okay? So let's talk, guys. Let's talk. All right, well, we got the Strength card and the Six of Swords that jumped out towards me. We got the Strength card, which is Leo's energy, the Six of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But this makes me feel like some of you have are trying to find the courage or having the, cur the courage to move on from a situation. Or having the courage to do something. Having the courage to say something. Okay, so let's see. All right, so. Give me a message for Capricorns for December the 1st through the 7th. Capricorn. Thank you. What does Capricorns need to know? What's going on with my Capricorns? Y'all being quite stubborn too. Okay, lots of water here. We got the Magician and the Ace of Pentacles. So some of you are trying to manifest some of you are trying to manifest, um, trying to manifest a new beginning, a new start, or some of y'all are trying to manifest some money. Okay. The magician and the ace of pentacles and the ten of cups. This would make you feel better. This would make you be happy. Okay. For sure, for sure. For sure, for sure. Y'all are in manifestation mode. <laughs> All right. We got unity, four of water. And the Knight of Cups. I'm sorry, Knight of Water. Lots of water here. Could be dealing with a water sign. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. All right, so Unity. I think this is more like the um, Balance card. Um, traditional viewpoints. Spiritual organization. Seeking out mentors and like-minded friends. Okay, so this is coming together. Coming together. So some of you may be trying to come together with a group of people and see how a group of people or, or you know, everybody's everybody else's viewpoints. You may be trying to get 
your your point across to some someone or a group of people. But maybe I don't I feel like you may be being misunderstood with this four of water. This four of water is missing an opportunity, discontentment, or boredom. Open your eyes to possibilities. So I feel like you're trying to get your point across to a group of people, but either they not feeling you or you not feeling them. Okay. Then we got the the night of water. Falling in love or wedding proposal, the need to balance emotions. This is also an invitation. Okay, so maybe you're asking for opinions or something to that nature. But I'm feeling like you have this idea or something that you're trying to manifest. And I feel like other people are giving you their opinions and how they feel, their viewpoints. And everybody's not agreeing or you're not seeing, you're not seeing it their side or they're not seeing it your side. Okay. Maybe you're trying to come together. You're trying to get everybody on the same page with unity. All right, so I'm going to turn these cards around and I'm going to turn them around one by one. You're going to start with unity because it came out first. So let's see what we get. Um, Give me a sec, y'all. I just want to see. It's a movie, and you're the best part. I had to get some water. You're the best part. Oh, you're the best part. All right, unity. And you know what? The magician and the ace of pentacles, that could be you making your, trying to get your point across. You, you're making a valid point. Um, and I feel like some of you are trying to get people to see your side and I don't feel like they are. Um, so let's see. Why is unity here? The two of cups, didn't I tell you? Being on the same page, ace of pentacles, again, okay? This could involve money, okay, with the ace of pentacles, or this is an opportunity. But unity and the two of cups, both of those are about coming together, okay? So I feel like you're trying to get somebody on the same page, but somebody, somebody start, starts telling lies, There's that tower card again. Like I told y'all, some, something out of the blue was said. Something out of the blue was said. Something out of the blue was done. That I feel like maybe you're looking back at it with regrets. Okay. Maybe you regret saying something or doing something. Somebody took something too far. You regret that. Maybe maybe you took it too far. And I feel like this is what this is. Um, maybe you took something too far and you're regretting it. Okay. So now it's like people keep bringing it up. Four of Pentacles. You know, this is like holding on. People are still holding on to it, to their feelings or how they feel about it. And this, this is what it's caused. This big tower moment this big <laughs> this big deal somebody took something too far okay that's what i'm getting like something was taken too far um now here with the four of water you could be disapp disappointed okay your intuition was telling you to wait your intuition was telling you to wait to to make this final decision okay so maybe you've been hesitant on you know bringing this situation or this this topic up but you went ahead and did it anyway i feel like you went ahead and did it but your intuition was telling you you know your intuition was telling you the way okay some of you walked away from something to try something new some of you walked away from something to try something new um somebody here was being a player too. Somebody here is just, I'm not necessarily like, for some, if this is love related, somebody here was definitely playing. Okay. Knight of Wands and Seven Cups. This is somebody who's all over the place. 
And with that Ace of Wands, yes. This is somebody who's been sleeping around. Somebody could even be married and sleeping around. Because I got the Hierophant and the Ten of Cups. Both of these cards symbolize a marriage. Okay, so somebody could have walked out, walked away from a marriage to be single, to do single things, trying, trying new stuff. Okay, but now you could uh, be to a point where you're kind of like burnt out from, from this. Being irrational, being all over the place. You know, you may be kind of burnt out and you're ready to try something new. So maybe you brought this up and your intuition was telling you, you know, to wait it out. But I feel like you went ahead and did it anyway. You were trying to get them to see your point of view. It didn't, it didn't happen like that. Yep. And something about coming back together. Um, Six of Cups and the Judgment is... Both of those cards symbolize the second chances or returning back to something or reviewing the past. And just like somebody said, somebody did not like your delivery or what you said, four of cups and that is swords. Somebody felt like you was, you was too harsh. How you said it was wrong. How you went about it was wrong. Okay. Somebody feel like what you said or how you said it to them was wrong. Okay. So this is the main issue. How it was said was wrong. Okay. Now we got Knight of Water. This is communication. Let's see. Why is the Knight of Water here? The Ten of Wands. Okay. So maybe you're you're done with what you know you 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 don't feel the need to bring the conversation up anymore. This conversation has burnt you out. You're you're kind of like done with it. Yeah, you're trying to leave it alone. You're trying to leave it alone. Why is the Ten of Wands here? And King of Wands. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Energy. Yeah, like, you're trying to be done with it because I feel like you're looking back at a, the way you did something. I feel like you, you kind of feel regretful. Okay? Somebody keeps bringing it up. Knight of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, very young childlike energy. Children could be involved. Um, but somebody took something too far. For sure, for sure. Why is the Five of Cups here? What's the regrets? Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. So there's a Queen of Wands and a King of Wands here. So, and the Ace of Cups and the Nine of Pentacles. Why is the Queen of Wands here? The King of Cups. Knight of Swords. Somebody went back and said, somebody's going back and telling telling other people things. But I feel like this situation is completely burning you out. Like this situation is completely burning you out. So let's get let's get down. Let's let's go ahead and get the TT. <laughs> I gotta drink. I gotta. I got to drink my water bunny because this is just a lot. This is a lot. Okay. Okay. Before we get all in there, let me clean y'all up. I'm going to clean y'all up first before we jump back, before we jump into this. Now, because cause what's going on here, I'm going to go ahead and go get a little bit more. I'm going to go a little deeper. About to go a little deeper here. Give me more. Okay. For some of you, this could involve family. Okay. You saw how that just jumped out. It could involve family. Okay. Family could be involved. Give me, a, give me some more information for Cap. Okay. The lovers. Lovers and distant horizon, main female. Okay. And a false person.
Give me one more card for Capricorn, please. Okay, message. Okay, so somebody's concerned. There's a message of concern here coming from... Um, okay, I'm getting a message of concern, poverty. Okay, so someone could be having issues as far as money. I'm seeing that as well, too. There could possibly even be a marriage involved, okay? So let's see. Give me more info about family room. Give me more info about family room. Courthouse. Okay, we got thoughts, imprisonment. Somebody thought that somebody was stuck or in a messed up situation. Um, or somebody thought that somebody was going to gift or give someone something. Um, why is lovers here? Thief. Sudden wealth. Somebody stole some money. What's going on? Mature woman. Okay, so there's a mother possibly involved. Okay, so somebody didn't see something coming. Okay. Somebody feels like somebody loves to lie or steal. Um, this could be something going on in the family. Family could definitely be involved. A mature woman. This is like someone's mother, aunt, someone older. Someone has a message of concern. Somebody's contacting someone's mother or something in like in that nature. Okay. I'm going to keep these cards to the side while I pull the tarot. Because this is going to give me some more insight. Okay, so. The Three of Pentacles and the Judgment card jumped. So this is definitely about cooperate. Somebody being cooperative. Oh, somebody's going against the... Somebody feels like somebody's going against the rules. Yeah, there's animosity. There's some lying going on. Somebody's lying here. Or lied about something. In the past, from the past, or something that happened. All right, so somebody has to make up their mind here. I'm seeing that as well, too. Somebody got to make up their mind. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? When I see the Three of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords in the same read, we got to get to the bottom of that. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? The world. All right. So. Whew. Somebody is pissed. Queen of Swords and the Nine of Pentacles. Somebody is feeling like they do things. They have to do everything. That they'd have to do everything on their own. Somebody's trying to save their money. And they're having to dish out a lot of money. I'm seeing that as well too. Okay. Queen of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, female or male here. Some of y'all are closed off, okay? So we got the world here and the three of pentacles. So maybe, yeah, uh, maybe you're trying to uh, close yourself off, okay? Somebody here is trying to force you, yeah. And I'm getting somebody's very aggressive. Somebody is mad. Like, I don't know if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with or that's around you. Oh, okay, it's you. It's you. 
King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, and you're you're kind of confused. Okay, you you haven't made up your mind. You haven't made up your mind. Okay, and you feel overwhelmed. You feel burnt out. Okay, you may just want to be kind of like left alone. All right. Um, uh, let's see. Why is um why is the Queen of Cups here? Seven of Pentacles. Okay, so Seven of Pentacles and the Two of Wands. Maybe you you can you know you're kind of like gonna wait till later. Cause I feel like oh, okay, the Eight of Pentacles and the Emperor. You could be dealing with the Aries, but you may be trying to work things out. A baby father could be involved, or a baby mother. This could be a baby mother, baby father situation. Um. But some of you could just, you know, just be trying to, you know, kind of like stay kind of at a distance and kind of wait to see how things are going to roll out. Because um, I'm getting somebody's pretty pissed right here. For sure, for sure. Um, and you feel like you have to stand your ground and you feel like everybody's, you're like kind of like in attack mode, like you're in defense mode right now. Okay, you, Queen of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, female, somebody you here wants a second chance on something, possibly a second chance on working, working something out together or being on the same page, but for sure, for sure, somebody here is spying, either you're spying on the Queen of Pentacles or, or a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, whoever the case may be. You're spying on somebody. Could be a king of wands or a queen of wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Somebody's expressing how they feel. Somebody is telling how they feel. Okay, why is the queen of pentacles here? Three of wands. Okay, maybe you're waiting for, waiting to see how this person is going to respond. Okay, or waiting to see if this person is going to cut you off. Why is the eight of wands here? Okay, an apology. Maybe you're waiting for this person to apologize to you. Oh, somebody's being a jerk. Ooh, the devil. This is y'all, devil. Capricorn energy, Knight of Wands. Somebody's, ooh, playing mind games. Y'all played somebody. I feel like y'all played somebody. And why is the nine of cups here? Y'all want to disappear. For past energy, y'all wanted to just disappear and just chill out, be at peace. But mm, I don't know what happened. Something happened. Why is the five of swords here? You may feel like this person loves drama. Ace of Cups and a Five of Swords. You want to walk away from this. Like, you trying to... You want to walk away. You want to walk away from, from that. You want to walk away from that. And I also feel like you feel like this person is lying. Okay? You feel like there's nothing for you to lie about. Um... You, we got the chariot and the uh, knight of wands. It's like you're saying, or someone is saying, I went there and I came right back, or trying to explain themselves, like trying to explain what, what happened. Yeah, somebody's trying to like question you about where you was at or where you've been. Why is the ten of swords here? For some of you, it's involving money. Like, you may feel like somebody's lying, saying that they don't have the money. And some, maybe you borrowed money from somebody or someone borrowed money from you and now they're saying that they don't got it. Um, and like right now you feel kind of at a place where, you know, you, you are having regrets because I feel like some of you let your guard down. Some of y'all let, let, yeah, see, I'm getting someone asked 
for something and somebody saying yes. Okay, so the Ace of Wands and the Knight of Cups, this could be someone saying yes or someone calling someone first. Could be a Libra. A Libra could be involved. How this, how the other person in the party is feeling or how others are viewing it. Somebody, they're viewing it like they thought you were better than that. Um, they thought that you were, you know, a friend, a true friend, or, you know, they just thought that you were better than that. So something has happened. They thought that you were genuine, that you cared But come to find out, they, they, they met the devil. So this is how they're viewing it. Knight of Swords. Your hopes and fears, you're tired of overstepping. You're tired of um you're tired of doing the the most. <laughs> um the outcome is the six of cups. You're you're waiting for them for this person to come back around. Because you're still holding on to it. Or they're still holding on to it. Um Yeah. Someone keeps posting. For some of you, this could be like going on on Facebook. Someone keeps talking about it and keeps bringing it up. And I feel like with the Six of Swords, like you're over it or you're trying to get over it. I'm hearing you knew better. Um, Y'all got to let me know what's going on because it's a lot going on here. Like, it's a lot going on here. It's a lot of extra, extra. Read all about it going on here. All right, so y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later, all right? Ciao.